Welcome back, everybody, to Hellblade Senua's Sacrifice. We have to get a new sword. Um, and in order to do that, it's, it's a sword that can kill gods. And in order to do that, we have to go through o Odin's trials. And if I remember correctly, this does take a little bit of time. Uh, maybe my old videos just didn't have anything cut out of them. But uh, there's a... F Wait a minute. Did it not... Son of a bitch. I think I have to redo the cutscene and all that, but essentially, uh, we have to go through Odin's trials in order to get the sword um, that will kill gods, or at least injure them, I don't know, and uh, it's gonna take a minute, but there's, there's, it's shattered into pieces, and in order to get those pieces, we have to go through Odin's trials. Okay, uh, right, going on to the shards. You need that sword. Like I said, I think this takes a little bit. I don't know if I just had so little editing in my old videos, or if it really does take some time to get this, but um, that's primarily what this episode's gonna be. To make a sword that would never fail and never rust, and that would slice through iron and stone and bring victory to its bearer. But the angry dwarves cursed it. It would be the death of a man every time it was drawn. And it would be the death of the king. Let me tell you about the sword, Tyrving. Okay. Tell me about it. I don't recognize this place. Where are we? Where is she? It feels wrong. Where are we now? Burial mound. It's so strange that we go to such lengths to bury death. Something so very ordinary, inevitable. It's as if we conspire to hide death because we have no answer for it. But when it comes and it forces itself onto our friends or loved ones, then comes the reckoning. I mean, in terms of, like, uh, hiding death, I don't know that you're necessarily hiding it. I think it's more like giving back, right? Not to get all Final Fantasy-y on you, but returning to the planet, I mean, unless you get cremated or donate your body to science, it's kind of what you're doing, right? Conservation of mass. You give yourself back to the planet. I mean, the world kind of has to eat through a box to get to you first, but, um, unless you just bury yourself uh, outside of a, uh, casket. Okay, maybe I shouldn't be talking about this. This is pretty morbid. Oh, fucking don't like that. Yeah, ask the giant monster who's there. Okay, fuck, I forgot how creepy this is. Uh, follow the moans. I'm here for the trials. Like when we first met, remember? What? When we first met? Okay, I think I have to light these? Um... There he is. There he is. What? Dillian, there he is. Finally, you found him. What's wrong? What happened? Can you hear me? Just wait there. I'll find you. Okay. Uh, can't go this way. But these torches are gonna show me where I've already been. I think. I can't sprint here. Oh, oh my god. I didn't fucking lose him. It's so dark, so dark, so dark. I'll find him. Alright, I'm listening. I think it's down this way. Don't touch. Turn back. She has to keep going. It's not safe here. Down this way. She has to keep going. If you go down there, no one can save you. It's too scary. Shut up. I can hear him. Okay, we got another one of these. Senua, you remind me of a story that the Northmen tell about a young woman warrior. Her name is Herver, 
the daughter of a berserker born after he was killed. She's a wild, willful child who teaches herself to fight with weapons. When she learns where her father is buried, her only desire is to reclaim the treasure buried with him, but above all, the sword, Tyrving. But that's not what the sword's called that we're after, right? Was it? Is it Tyrving? It's getting louder. Listen, Dillian. Listen, listen, listen. It's him. Listen. Oh, Dillian. Oh man, he sounds like he's in pain. Oh, I hate that. I hate it. I hate it so much, but I love it. I love this game. Down to the right. Okay, okay. I'm here. I think it's down that way. I think if you go down one of these passageways one too many times with the wrong way, then it then it resets. Can I What the fuck? Oh, I thought that was a person. Maybe. I mean, there's probably a way in this. It's not Dillion. Oh God. Oh God. Hello. Oh fuck! It's glowing red in there. I take it that I have to go this way. Oh, Jesus Christ. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, this is closed, but there's something else I have to do. Do I have to do this? Yeah, I think... I think that opened it. My controller vibrated. Oh, okay, that, o that, that torched one of them. I remember being stuck on this. For that reason. There's another torch somewhere that I need to light. I think? Or maybe I just go up to it. Dillian wants me to face my fears. Was that it? Yeah, I think I was I think I was stuck thinking it would open by itself. But it never did. I just had to go up and push the door open. Oh god, I hate this. Paula? It's her dad? I'm leaving. I've decided. I think it will be good for me. It's the darkness. It's speaking through No, Dad, it's me. I think I can beat it. In my own way. Uh, I can see the darkness in your eyes, child. I met a boy. Is boy. the chief had some. No. He said he could help me. It's a trick. He said it could be normal. Normal? Yes. The dark voices, her father's? No boy is going to save you. No one can. When they see the rot growing no. inside you. No. They will turn their back on you! The gods can only fix you through my hand! You're going nowhere! Ugh, this is... not no. a great feeling. You will not defy the gods! Okay, alright. I didn't hit you, Senua, okay? It was something Senua, else. Take my hand. Come. I am leaving! 
You cannot escape the darkness. Your curse will make everyone suffer. You will have blood on your hands! Okay, Jesus Christ. That didn't take too long at all. Um... It's done. Alright, it. it's there's done. More. There's more. I know, I know there's more. There's still more. There's more. It's not... It's, it's not only the glowing ones, ones, right? So... I'm not getting tired, I just started. Can you do one? Yep. Yep. I've got the energy, I'm doing just fine. My back hurts a little, but that's just the price of getting old, I think. I saw once a plague strike northern lands of ice. It was so terrible that not the oldest man among us could remember the like. Hundreds died. The sickness took nearly every person younger than 40, and many older. And where dying mothers gave birth, the marks of the plague were on the babes as they came out of the womb. Took every person younger than the age of 40? That's fucking insane. Wouldn't you expect younger people to have better immune systems? I mean, obviously not babies or children, but like, young adults? What is this place? Creepy is an understatement. Where is it? Where are we? Turn back. Okay, let me just turn back. There he is. There he is. The light. Go towards it. He's in the house. Find He's going again. He's disappearing. Follow him. Don't let him disappear. I'm going, I'm going. Keep going. How do you find it? Well, I'm going to go to the last place I saw it. Like the old warrior trials. Dillian will help me. The stench of rot. Oh God. She can almost taste it. Yeah. No, I. No. Don't worry. Not everyone can. Uh. It was a warm spring day when she went to the river with Dillian and the others. To the water. She could taste the rot. But no one else could. She knew something was wrong. Something sinister. She begged them to leave, but they just laughed at her. But soon enough, as the bodies piled up, no one was laughing. Uh... They knew that she was not like that. When the bodies piled up, can you add a little more detail? Fix it. You have to fix it. Yeah. I'm gonna fucking look at it from a certain angle. And that's gonna fix it. Get to the house and finish this trial. It doesn't finish until you get to the house. Before he disappears. How do I Where am I going? Through here? Do I have to look at it from above? I bet I do. And I can't go through there because it's not so I have to go through this fucking There we go. That's it. You did it. Shit. Okay. It's not done yet. And then I gotta go back through this one more time. There we go. I'm fucking smart. I've been trying to tell you guys. You can see it. Aligned the truth. The bridge. Alright, and then just gotta line this up like so. So she did it, did it. You're goddamn right I did. Fixed it. You passed the trial, get to the house. You succeeded. Uh I don't like that those things eyes are glowing. Hope there's nothing in the water. I really don't remember if there is or not, but it just seems like something they would do. Hello, Dillian? Oh, and the light is vanquished. Dilly? Come to me. Dilly Dally? I'm here. I'm right here. 
Are you in there? Find him. Are you in there? Find him. The runes. Focus. Ugh, God, ouch. Delius! They're coming for me! What? What is happening? What is that? It's close. It's close. Move away. Run. Oh my god. Oh my god. What? No, I'm not. I didn't. Ugh, so fucking lame, dude. God damn it. I'm going away. I'm going away. Uh -uh. Okay, okay. Uh, got this one. Okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. Nope, 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 through here. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Oh shit, oh fuck, oh shit, oh fuck, oh shit, oh fuck, fuck, oh, fuck. shit, fuck. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, 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 shit. Go, 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 fuck, fuck, shit, fuck, oh god, no! What should I do? Oh god, uh, uh. Come on, come on, come on, come on, shit, shit. Oh god, I got it, I got it. Go! Go, 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 shit. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Uh, there we go. I got it. I got it. Easy peasy. <laughs> fuck that thing, dude. Oh. <sighs> Uh, a little bit of stutter there. It's all good. Senua! Senua! What happened? They're blaming me for the plague. They say that I'm cursed. What if they're right? How would they know such a thing? Are they gods? None of us are. They're just... people. Good people, but... they're scared. They're afraid of what they can't see. Like children scared of the dark. They make up stories to fill the void. It doesn't make them true. What if my father was right? You have to step out of this darkness. Let them see who you really are, like I am. You're not a monster. Ugh, this would be... Ten... Uh, this would be pretty worse. I was gonna say ten million times, but I don't even know what it's like... In the first place. This would be so hard to deal with in in a period of time where people were, you know, superstitious. What if, you're wrong? if you say the wrong thing during the wrong time, and you struggle to do ordinary things due to a mental condition that you have, how are you not going to have your head on a spike by the end of the week, you know? Oh, fuck. Alright. Uh, I think it... This is probably the last shard. I want shard. to tell you a story about a god of the Northmen called Baldur. Fuck. The second Baldur. son of Odin. He was beautiful, good, and wise. He looked like trailer trash. <laughs> At least, according to God of War. He was fair of feature. He spoke fair words. He gave fair judgments. Mm. Light shone from him. Only good things were told of him. Yet he was the first of the gods to die by Kratos' hand. Actually, no. 
Thor's sons. Well, they were demigods. Right? Were they half gods? Or were they whole gods? Uh, was, was, um, damn it, what was her name? Um, Sif? Was she, uh, was she a god or was she mortal? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, not really important. Not even in the same... They're not even going off the same shit, so what does it matter? I mean, they're going off the same shit, but they're not... You know what I'm trying to say. I don't know. I'm gonna fucking figure it out. Uh, okay, so it brings the bridge together. And it's I can't dangerous. go that way. Don't go near it. Okay. Don't go there. Don't go too close. Don't go. Where are we? What is this? It's the same. And then this one takes us back into the night. It's lighter. It's nicer. The bridge. It's not broken. It's fixed. What I fixed it by looking into the mask. Let's cross it. Okay. Uh, maybe this one takes a minute. This door is blocked, of course. Ooh, I never got this one. The Northmen tell how the gods mourned Baldur. His body was to be burnt on his ship, but they could not manage to push it into the sea and sent for a giantess to do it. She comes riding a wolf and has vipers for her reins. She pushes Baldur's ship into the sea with such force that the ground shakes and the rollers burst into flames. When Baldur's wife sees his body carried onto the ship, her heart bursts with grief, and she dies. She's put next to her husband, and the pyre is lit, sending the dead to hell. But even so, the gods cannot accept his death. But what does that mean? Can't accept his death? Do they send somebody into hell to get him? You can. You need the runes to fight. All right. Uh, need the rune. Where is it at? He's close. He loves you. Calling you, Dillian. Dillian, we're here. Oh, Dillian. Dillian, I'm here. Okay, and then I suspect it's probably somewhere in here, so. Oh, now we can get into the back. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. The gate is open. Go through the gate. Go through it. It's dangerous. Follow it. Well, of course I'm gonna go through the gate. Probably to the next piece of the puzzle. Another place to change course. What? Okay. All right, now we can get in. And I gotta unlock that other gate, don't I? Wait a minute. Uh, there's this here. Seems so simple. Black and white. Darkness and light. Narrow dividing lines of our own making. Dillian taught her to see further. To peek through the cracks and see the worlds of color stretching away from the glue. Senna explored new paths into the unknown. Okay. The Northmen tell this story about the death of Baldur. It begins with dark dreams. Night after night, Baldur dreams of his own death, and the gods fear for his life. So Baldur's mother makes everything in the world fire, water, iron, stone, earth, wood. Beasts, birds, serpents, poison, sickness, swear an oath not to harm her son. One by one, they each make their vow. Neither weapons nor wood will injure him, Baldur's mother boasts. Only Loki, 
father of Hela, the mistress of death, is not amused. Huh. These are very, very cool, uh, you know, like, um, it's a very cool interpretation of the Norse mythology. I, I know I've said that before already, but uh, I, you're right. No, nope, you're right. I can't go up there. Um, it's just cool to see that, like, parallels, but also it's like, it's like, <laughs> It's like playing Final Fantasy. Way to retell the same story with different aspects. Alright, now we can open this up. Okay, real quick, I'm gonna check and make sure that nothing's down here. Yeah, uh, I can't say that I do. Uh, Alright, I'm a little confused. Oh, there it is. How the hell do I get back there? Damn it, I need to be higher. Opening this fucking gate can't have meant nothing. What the fuck am I missing here? Are you shitting me? God damn it. You've got it. Yeah, I know. Why isn't he here? He's gone. He's in the dark world. He's gone to the dark world. You're in the wrong world. He's in the other world. The dark Remember world. Remember the silence. Silence. No. And we can make it inside now. Come on, open the doors. You are guilty. Was it there? Where are you taking He's up there. He's up there. How do you get up Uh, by looking at the stairs like this. Oh shit, I missed this one too. Overcome with grief, the gods send Hermod to ride to Hell and ask Hela to let Baldur return home. All the gods are weeping, he says. Are they? asks Hela. We shall see if he is truly missed. If everything in the world will weep for him, he shall go back to the gods. But if even one thing refuses, Baldur stays with me. The gods send messengers everywhere. Weep for Baldur. Weep him out of hell. And everything wept. Men, beasts, earth, stone, trees, metal, everything. Except for a giantess they find in a cave. Baldur was never my friend, she says. Let hell keep what she has. The Northmen say that the giantess must have been Loki in disguise. Well, is... are you gonna tell us? Was it? Dillian? God damn it. The gods feast and rejoice and amuse themselves by throwing spears and stones at Baldur, striking at him with sword and axe. But he comes to no harm, whatever they do. The gods never cease to wonder at this great marvel. But Loki shapes himself into a woman and asks Baldur's mother, is it really true that all things promise to keep him safe? I did not ask the mistletoe Baldur's mother confesses. I thought it was too young. Oh dear. Huh. Seems a little bit out of order, but... Yeah, that's how Loki found out that, uh... 
that he had a weakness, I guess. All right, uh, what what am I looking for? He's at the end of the bridge. Nobody will love her now. Can you remember what love feels like? Look what happens to the thing she loves. She destroys the thing she loves. All right, TMS. Years have passed since she left her father. She trained hard alongside her friend. He was Dillian. She saw things no one else could. Patterns, shapes, movement. Why is my controller vibrating? An intuition that made her an exceptional warrior. Friendship turned to love. The shadow of darkness never let her go, and she was caught between two worlds. That of Zinbel and her past, and Dillian, the future. Two realities tearing at her soul. I think it was vibrating because I got close to one of these masks. He was the only one that didn't mind the curse. Uh... Where is this thing at? Hello, where's the symbol? There it is. Except I have to be on the other fucking side. Loki makes a dart out of mistletoe and goes to the gods as they throw things at Baldur. The blind god, Huth, was there. Loki asks him why he wasn't taking part. Hoof says, I cannot see where Baldur stands, and even if I could see him, I have no weapon. Loki replies, Here is a wand. I will tell you where he stands. And Hoof throws the mistletoe at Baldur. It pierces through him, and to everyone's horror, Baldur is killed. And for this... In a way that Hood is slim. Damn. The perfect fucking crime. Just get a blind guy to do it. Alright, both sides are open now. You son of a fucking god damn it. This is the one that took forever, isn't it? Aha! I see it. Alright, we got one. You have no time for this. Speed is up. I mean, what if? At least the gods will see I have excellent puzzle solving skills. Okay, now I can... Yeah, 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 yeah. Got it, got it, got it. Alright, we got this one. One more. Right? There it is. I see it. I see it. I see it. But really, the gods are playing with you. It makes sense in your mind, but it doesn't matter to them. I gotta go back upstairs. Right? Am I supposed to be going upstairs? What am I doing? There we go. It's downstairs. Okay. Yours still alive and 
Oh, Dillian! Wait a minute, do I have to go back one more time? No, I have to... I have to cross this. Holy shit, okay. Dillian! Oh yeah, sure, me come over there. What's over there, dude? I'm sure it's not that interesting. Dillian never much cared for the underworld. Oh god, okay, okay, I got this. And looks dimly upon the druids, like our father, huh? I guess Whoa. he took after his father. Oh fuck. A chieftain who believed nothing he couldn't see. And he happened to be blind. Oh god. She felt safe in Dillian's arms. Learned to see the world through his eyes. Slowly. Oh fuck. Darkness that had bound her so tightly. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Come on. Come on. My thumbs are wiggling so much. Oh, fuck. Okay. Hey! I'll take that hug now. Thank you. Oh my god. That actually scared the shit out of me. Jesus fucking Christ. The yell and the jump were just both fucking terrifying. I don't know why. It spooked me so much that he jumped, but... Your father cannot understand your darkness. He cannot see through your eyes. No one can. My own father was born blind. He doesn't have the faintest idea of what the night looks like. The word dark to him means as little as the word light. So someone is afraid of the dark. Should we fix them by taking away their sight? But you give up the beautiful world. You, and only you, can see just to be rid of your nightmares. Or is this the price you pay for the gift you have? gift that makes you so special in my eyes. Just another part of the person I know. Alright, Mr. Perfect. Your girlfriend has a serious mental issue. <laughs> I left for the wilds to protect you from my darkness. Because I love you. But it made it worse. I'm so sorry. So while she was gone in the wilds to face her darkness? Um, was Dillian killed? Did the Northman come and, and kill him while she was gone? Come on, do I? God damn it, do I have to go all the way back up? Oh, I have to go all the way around. It's fine, it's fine. I'll just listen to the voices in my head until I get there. Memories were yours, but they're the gods now. Nothing is yours anymore. It's disappearing with your memories. All right, give me that goddamn thing. It's mine now. It's mine. Take it. Just fucking rip it out of there like a band-aid. Come on. What is happening? Is there another trial? What's going on here? I just walked past all of them. What? What? Oh my fucking! And of course I can't walk over these fucking rocks. God damn it! Okay, what's this last piece you got? The Northmen say that their all father, Odin, gave his eye in exchange for a drink from Mimir's well, the well of wisdom. The smartest man alive! In blindness, there can be wisdom. Only by giving can you receive in return. For this reason, I give my life and pass on my stories of the Northmen to you, Senua. Can you hear me? Dillian. 
I'm right here. Can't you see me? Help me. Breathe slow. It's the darkness. Stay still. Empty your thoughts. Okay. Where are you at? Tell me what you feel. Okay. A breeze. Good. Then there is a way out. Alright. I can't tell where it comes from. Yes, you can. Just keep... The others. The voices. They've gone. I'm still here. Okay. Well, good. Keep so quiet. talking to me. So dark. It's okay. Listen to your own breath. Is, rise and fall. is that the breeze? My Good. controller's vibrating. Be aware of everything you hear and feel. Let your senses guide you. Go on. I'm going. Uh... This way? I can't go on. Delia? Find a way. I'm not leaving you here. Alright, uh... This way. I hear wind chimes. What the fuck is that? More fire? Menacing whispers? Breeze again, my controller's vibrating. Just calmly going along. I think I'm somewhere else now. But the breeze has gone. Use all of your senses. Let the world speak to you. What do you hear? Water? I hear water. Go to Somewhere... Somewhere this way. Is this the water? It's reached the water. Good. That's your way out. Follow it upstream. Upstream. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. I'm so sorry. I thought I left this all behind. Don't be sorry. It's not your fault. He was right. It's inside of me. It won't let me go. Jenna. My father. He taught me that the hardest battles are fought in the mind. Not the soul. You're no coward. He proved that to me in the warrior tribes. This is just another battle. You can beat him. This isn't so bad. You don't have to help him. Don't tell him that. I want help. I want to. Besides. Oh God. I'm going to be a great warrior one day. We need people like you. There's dead people in the water. I'll do my best. There's dead people in the water. the end of the thing so Dillian Dillian can you speak to me I don't know what's inside <sighs> but I'm gonna fucking go down right. oh fuck oh I don't like that Do you see it? No. 
and it cannot see you. Quietly move past it, one step at a time. Does it move? Why is it doing that? It's like zooming in. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. Fucking hell. Oh my god, okay. Shut the fuck up, Senua. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Shit, shit, fuck shit. Stop! What are you doing? Why? Why? Why is it doing that? Where am I going? What am I doing here? Is that... Are those chains? Don't walk into those. Okay, come on. Come on. Just get close, but don't go right to it. Ah, oh, there's more chains. Fuck. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh my fucking Christ. Please don't find me. Oh God, oh God, I'm taking the risk, I'm taking the risk, I'm going. Slow, slow, I'm going slow. <sighs> okay, come on, come on, come on. Go, go. Oh, thank the fucking lord. Oh, shit. Uh... This way? More of them? Are you shitting me? I have to move through this fucking crowd of bullshit? Go, 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 go. There is more of them. I think they're moving. You're breathing too fast. I'm scared. This is the sound of your breath. In and out. Fuck. In and out. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 go. It will. Go, 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 please, please, please. Oh, come on, come on. Oh, God. Fuck. Please make it stop. Make it stop. Okay, okay. I don't see anyone else. I don't see anything. I'm going for it. Go, 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 please, please, please. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Hey. Check it out, man. We fucking made it. Can this please be the end of the trial? I am so very tense. It stinks. Of death. He said, don't worry. I just took a shit. You are <laughs> Had a little bit of Taco Bell. That's all it was. Nobody's dead. It's just a really fat fart. Oh god, okay, okay. Don't fall down there. I don't even know how to tell which way I'm leaning. I can't see anything. I can't see the beam. Okay, come on. Come on. I got this. I got it. I got it. There we go. There we go. As well. Don't turn back. You're getting close. It's like, oh, don't, don't jump in there. That's where I took the shit. That is where I took the shit. Cool. This is not the goddamn end. Please. Oh, this is terrible. Please. Help me. Please. Come to me, sir. What?
that light, right? Oh, God. Are you serious? Don't hit the bodies, don't hit the bodies, don't hit the bodies, go, go. Don't hit the bodies, don't hit the bodies, don't hit the bodies, go, go. Don't hit the bodies, don't hit the bodies, don't hit the bodies, go, 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 go. Don't hit the bodies, don't hit the fucking bodies, go, go, go. Don't hit the bodies, go, go, go. Don't hit them, no, no. Oh god, keep going, fuck. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Oh. Jesus. Yep, I'm coming. I'm just running, dude. I don't give a shit anymore. Get me the fuck out of this trial. God, my entire body just feels like I've been flexing it. Ugh. Oh, God. She could spend hours, days even, trapped within herself in the dark. You see me? A little bit of stutter. Yes. Your eyes were open, but you were... gone. And when it finally let her go, she could be anywhere, with no memory of how she got there. When it comes for me, I have no power over it. But here, for the first time, Someone was there to help. But I heard your voice. You brought me back. You found your own way back. All you needed was a little help. A little hope. Ah. <sighs> Oh, look at that. It's an eye with a fucking slash mark through it. Now I get to go all the way fucking back. With grammar reforged, you will have Odin's blessing to walk a goddess into the halls of Helheim and challenge Hela as an equal. So Dillion was helping me. And a sword will lead me to him. Like when we first met. Yeah, probably. All right, give me this Dillian fucking thing. The strength to pass the warrior trials, and she saw a way out to leave her past behind and become a warrior in Dillian's clan. Go back, go back, go back, go back. Stop. The sword is tainted by the gods of darkness. Leave it. No. Fuck you, Dad. He left it here. He wants me to take it. You will pay a price for this. But years later, with Zinbel's parting words still haunting her, the darkness came back with a vengeance. A plague. Do you? Everyone suffered. My father was not supposed to die like this. Do you see it clearly now, Senua? The suffering you've caused. This is your fault. You brought this plague to us. You have blood on your hands. Is that what actually happened, though? Maybe it is. Maybe it is what actually happened, and that's why she went into the forest to, to try and get rid of her They're darkness. To she told herself that she would get rid of it after she thought that, you know, she would... You know, uh, there's a lot of voices in my head right now. It's kind of hard to talk, but you get what I'm trying to say. Okay, ouch. I was living in Ghost of Tsushima. 
Whoa. Why focus when I can just fucking whack? Oh, ouch! I'm cutting these motherfuckers down. That's right, don't get too close to the walls. The corpse waved through itself over the ones I loved. The ship broke up under them. The ship that had sailed from the land of shining fields. Their memorial stone is sacred. Come not here in the sun. Come not with a sword. Come not crying over a naked corpse. Come not with disturbed mind. I don't think this is any sort of setting for me to come. <laughs> this is not really my thing, honestly. Does your precious gift of sight let you see the souls that rot here in this sea of corpses? Do you feel the blood running cold on your skin? Do you hear their endless cries? Do you smell their putrid wounds? They were once brothers, sisters, and loved ones. And look at what you have done to them. Whoops. Or because you were a coward because you ran from the curse instead of facing it. When you turned your back on your father, Zimbel, you turned your back on the gods and let the darkness wreak havoc on your people. <sighs> Why must they pay for your heresy? Oh, fuck. Come on, dude. Jesus Christ. How fucking tough are these guys? Oh, shit. Oh. Come on. Uh. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Ouch, ouch. Get up. Oh! No, 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 no. Get up, get up, get up, get up, come, 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 come. Oh, fuck. I'll be alright. I'll be alright. Holy shit. Ah! This way? Darkness took her life and it will take yours. It's taking Mother! I need you! Help me! This is actual hell. It's not too late. 
she's calling for you. Why don't you join her? Fuck you, Dad. It ain't that simple. Oh. Ah. Oh. How are you moving this fast? Uh oh. Uh -oh. Holy shit. That's a lot of them. Ugh. Uh, uh. Uh. Holy fuck. Uh-oh. Bitch! Alright, come on, big guy. Oh! Come on, come on, come on! Come on! Holy fuck, there's so many. Come on. Fucking bitch. Just 
Fucking goosebumps. You're both dead. You both surrendered to the voices. The darkness has taken you. Galena and Senwa. Galena and Senwa. You are lost. I mean, it is kind of up for interpretation. Maybe she is already dead. Who really knows? Oh, God, dude. What an absolutely terrifying fucking thought. <sighs> How do people think of this shit? What am I climbing on? The shoulder of a dead person? Oh, the hand is moving. Oh, God. Galena? Mama? Mama! I can't fight it anymore! Not on my own! Where are you, Mother? I want to be with you. <laughs> that night, she gave up on her world. What? To follow in the footsteps of her mother. To go to a place where the darkness couldn't reach her. Sanoa? What are you doing? Sanoa. Look at me. Do you hear them? They're calling for me. We've lost so many. And I've lost my father. I can't lose you. You said it. I have blood on my hands. I didn't say that. You've done nothing wrong. It was her psychosis that... that did that to her. Zimbal was right. Everyone will suffer. Zimbal is a fake. He is a hateful, bitter liar. He's poison. And his words still haunt you. Who do you trust? Him? Or me? Do you still believe in me, Senua? In us? Come back to me. That looks a lot better. He gave her the sword with which to fight in more ways than one. And she gave him her word, never to surrender. All she needed was a little help. A little hope. All right. Jesus Christ. I think I'm going to end that episode right there, if memory serves. We've only got about one or two more parts left. Uh, about a combined maybe two hours. And, uh, and then it's all over. And we can continue on with Hellblade 2 when it comes out. But, um, yeah. I, 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 I like that I... 
I chose the option to go back and play this again because this is actually I feel I feel like I'm getting a much better grip on the story than I did back then. I, maybe it's just you know, maybe my memory just it wasn't as tight, uh, and I I got this all the first time. But uh, I I definitely feel like I'm I'm asking the right questions and trying to throw in some different perspectives and, and really understand different things about it. I don't know, but. Uh, I'm enjoying it. I hope you're enjoying it. And all I really have to say is if you made it to this part of the video, you might as well subscribe because why the hell not? And if you wouldn't mind leaving a like on your way out the door, it would be sincerely appreciated. Of course, if you do plan on sticking around, I hope you see me in the next one. Thanks again.